I'm with my grandson this week and we have decided to make ice cream today. Thankfully, I brought my Pamper Chef ice cream maker so it will be quick and easy. So we're gonna start with our whole milk of one cup, half a cup of sugar, two cups or a pint of heavy whipping cream, and a teaspoon of vanilla. I'm using Pampered Chef's double strength, and I'm gonna use the whole teaspoon because I love vanilla, and so does my grandson. But you could really just use half if you wanted to. Now, I'm making vanilla, or I should say we're making vanilla, but there are other recipes on our website for coffee, strawberry, custard, so you can check those out later if you'd like. So now I'm gonna just whip it. Oh, it smells so good. I can already smell that vanilla coming out. So we're gonna continue whisking for a minute and then we're gonna put it in the fridge for 20 minutes. So now I'm gonna put it in the fridge and then Micah and I will take it out in 20 minutes and see if it's ready to go in our ice cream. Okay, so I'm gonna take the bowl out. We have had this in the freezer for 24 hours. That helps your ice cream to process. This is the bottom part of the ice cream maker. And then we're going to put the top on. It has two little clips there that slide into place and lock it. And we're gonna plug it in. And then we're gonna pour. We're gonna, first we're gonna turn it on. I said that backwards. So we got 20 minutes and we're gonna start pouring it in. The paddles are turning. You can see that, or the paddle is turning. And it only takes 20 minutes. This is four ingredients. 20 minutes in the fridge, 20 minutes in the ice cream maker, and you have soft serve ice cream. So you can see the ice cream getting thicker the more we get into it. We've got about seven minutes left and we'll check it. So we're checking it and you can see that it's still not quite thick enough. So I'm gonna add, um, sometimes it takes as much as another 20 minutes. So I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna add. Okay, so I think our ice cream is done. It was in here for about an hour. I kept checking it and I like it, a, you know, about this consistency. Now, if you like it a little bit um, thicker, you can put it in the freezer. It comes, well, it is kind of soupy. So what I might do is put it in our freezer for a little bit. It comes. Okay, so we've taken the ice cream out of the freezer and it is ready to go. It looks amazing. I'm gonna put it in my bowl. And I'm going to taste it. Mmm. Yum, where are the toppings? 